as I was introduced, Stephen Reynolds, Matt's brother, um, and lucky enough to be the best man and getting to talk about these two great people. As some of you might know, you might hear some common themes tonight, but uh, they met at a wedding, uh, my cousin Keenan's wedding a little more than four years ago. And we were all there to see Matt meet what would go on to be the love of his life, now wife. Although we all wish Matt's dance moves won her over that night, it took a little more work to get to their first date. But as I was sitting there thinking about kind of how great these two people are, I thought about how the two of them and their relationship are a lot like a great wedding. about a great wedding, think about how many stories come from one night. We all know that Matt can tell a story better than any of us brothers. His stories make you feel like you're there. And with a little bit of Reynolds embellishment mixed in, he keeps everybody engaged. I guess I'll start off by introducing myself like the others. I'm Matt Reynolds, uh, <laughs> luckiest man alive. Uh, if you'll indulge the father and the bride for a minute, I will just tell you a little bit about Alyssa for those of you who don't know her very well. Um, Alyssa is beautiful. She lights up every room she walks into with a quiet confidence and an easy smile. I don't know if Alyssa will ever truly understand how proud we are of her. She has been everything we could ever have hoped for. Growing up from being a little girl to a young woman. So, thank you for that. A great wedding is thoughtful and takes into account every detail. Alyssa is one of the most thoughtful people I've ever met. Whether it comes to giving a gift, which Matt has miraculously gotten much better at, remembering birthdays, or especially the way that she and the McAndrews family welcomed my wife Campbell and I when we came to Connecticut. It always comes from a thoughtful and heartfelt place. Alyssa and I are originally friends from Bucknell Tennis. We met the summer before our senior year of high school at a tennis recruiting camp, and we went on our official visits to Bucknell together. That weekend, we committed to Bucknell Tennis together. When I committed that day, I thought I was gaining a teammate for the next four years. I actually gained much more than that, a lifelong friend. You make those around you feel comfortable, special, and important, your love is infectious. After all, there is a reason why this giant ballroom is filled. <laughs> what a privilege it has been to witness your love. Thank you once again for including me in your beautiful journey. I can't wait to see your lives together as you grow stronger in love. May you have a long and happy marriage and may every day be as good as today. A great wedding brings people together and creates friendships and bonds. I know it's been said tonight, John, you pointed out really well, Matt's just a great hang. Our house at 1711 Wingate Drive in Gainesville, Georgia was effectively a revolving door for the better part of our high school for whatever sports team Matt was playing for. If you're with a group of great people, Matt Reynolds is always the common denominator. He's just an amazing guy and he's amazing at bringing people together. I have a, a close friend of mine from high school goes, this was, I told him that this is a couple of weeks ago, goes, oh, you going to Matt's wedding? When's he moving back to Chicago? <laughs> Matt never lived in Chicago. <laughs> That's the kind of impression he makes. And it's pretty rare that you get to say both people getting married are your friends. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was coming. <laughs> and uh, Matt, I'm really grateful for that. <laughs> Sorry. Love you too. Okay. I could sit here and say Matt and Alyssa are the perfect match. And I, I think that. But <laughs> more importantly, I think you're each other's perfect partner. 
They are the most inclusive, loyal people I know. <laughs> Happy tears, for sure. Um, they want to make sure everyone around them is having the best time. And they take the good in people and leave the rest because they know what matters. They don't sweat the small things. They keep things always in perspective, and they're always there for you. So, okay. <laughs> All right. So just remember to pick each other up, cheer each other on, and go the extra mile. Alyssa, I will always be there to be your doubles partner if needed. And Matt... Never forget, you really aced it by landing my beautiful best friend. <laughs> A wedding is about bringing together two families. Matt and Alyssa are both very family oriented, would do anything for their relatives. No matter where Matt was in the US, Matt always makes sure to be there for the big events. Alyssa, you and your family have a special bond. Your commitment to your family, the amazing friendship you have with your parents, with John, with Amy, it's a model for any family. And we're so happy to have that join ours. love each other very much, and I've never seen my brother as happy as he is with Alyssa. We knew for a while that Alyssa was the one, just like all of us brothers, would tell just about everybody, you know, about nine months prior that he was going to engage before the big day. But he truly loves her and it's amazing to see him out and how happy the two of them are. And we know Alyssa loves Matt, but it's never more apparent than when she continues to attentively listen to all of Matt's stories for most likely the 20th time. So to everyone here tonight, I ask you to raise a glass to cheers this great pair and tonight's great wedding. 
Alyssa, we cannot be happier to have you join our crazy family. Love you both. Alyssa was at our house in Chicago for Christmas and she was flying back to New York into Newark airport and Matt you were kind enough to say I'm gonna wait for Alyssa for two and a half hours until she arrives and then we can go back into the city together and my wife said he is a keeper <laughs> that's all I need to know that Matt was willing to wait in Newark Airport of all places for Alyssa to show up a few hours later and go home together. And I'm thinking to myself, not so fast. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm thinking not so fast because there was another story about Alyssa and Matt playing golf, which I'm glad you guys brought up because Matt had just got a new driver. <laughs> and yes. Alyssa was playing out of his bag, as they sometimes do, because Alyssa's just new, taking up his book. And Matt, you wouldn't let her hit your driver. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm thinking, we need to remeasure. <laughs> I don't know if you're a keeper or not, so we gotta kinda go through another series of things. Is the timing right? Is this okay? And then over the years, and months, you proved yourself to be a true keeper. Aww. Thelma and Joe Morelli aren't here tonight, but they would totally approve of the wedding. Aww. And I just want to wish you the best of life together. We are so excited to have Alyssa joining our crew. Um, she is beauty and grace and a phenomenal athlete. And honestly, she played golf with us. And I think you picked up golf like two years ago, right? And she's already a lot better than Jeff. A lot better than Jeff. <laughs> It's, it's, um, it's, it's pretty easy. Eh. <laughs> Sorry about that, Jeff. I'm, I'm just, maybe I'll end the, the 15 to 18 month old theme, but I'll we'll end it here unless there's another one that, another 15 to 18 month old um, that has been impacted by Matt and Alyssa, but. <laughs> it's a target market. <laughs> We love you, we adore you, and I'm so glad I changed that seating chart at the very last minute for Keenan and Mike.